kind of friends do you have? Bato, bato sa langit? Ang tama, huwag mo kayong magkaya. Question. Panagayin natin. Let's think we are in the class. And this is question and answer. Yourself. What kind of friends do you have? I don't class in friends. There are two kinds of friends. I did think. Bad, good, and good and bad. Middle. Middle. Basahin mo nga yung sabi ng yung first Corinthians not be misled by company or Do not be misled. Corrupt company. Uh, bad company corrupts good character. Bad company corrupts, corrupts good, good character. Because you have Yana. I did not say that. Who's going to answer He said. Yana huh? said. Do not be misled. Bad companies corrupts good character. You know what is a character? Your principle. Your character exposes you. The way inside in, it goes out. Corinthians 15, 33, do not be misled. Bad companies corrupts good character. If you lead non-Christian ship your thinking, you will conform into the ways of the world instead of the way of God. So anong, anong klase ang mga kaibigan mo? What kind of friends do you, you go through? Sunday you go to Christians. The weekdays you go to where? Many Christians do not believe in the resurrection of Christ because they don't they, they don't listen. Such as they are like the Sadducees and all the unbelievers and let other people influence their thinking. In Paul attempting to convince the Corinthians of the church in certainly Jesus' resurrection from the dead and it is and after his crucifixion Paul told the Corinthians that his believer will come and live again into their death kaya nga whatever we talk with that will change our principles in our character it will shift tignan mo ah Ikaw to. <clears throat> Magkiusap ka sa isa. Have you ever experienced that? You talk to the other person and then tatawid ka sa kabila. Ano sa palagay mo? What do you think? Do you have? And both of them, you have to believe in, 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 in what they are saying. Kung yung isang company mo ay palaging pupunta sa bar, of course, you go to bar, you will say, oh, I'm going there to witness for Christ. Is shaky naman yung relationship mo sa Panginoon, di ba? What happened to you? You will be influenced by them. My mother once said, Juan, sabi niya sa akin, alam mo, ang hinahina yung utak mo. Kaya ang advice ko sa sa'yo, makipagkaibigan ka sa may yung mga magagaling. Don't pretend to know everything. Makinig ka sa mga taong may matari, matali sa utak. Don't pretend to know everything, Joanne. Eh, anong ginawa ko eh? Witness ko yung math eh. But when it comes to sports, I'm very sporty. Tapos yung isa naman, yung ginawa ko, Nagkipagkaibigan ako lahat. Sabi niya sa akin, ito ang turo ng aking nanay. Every subject you make a friend to people who are good, that has a good brain. Yan ang turo ng nanay ko. Yan ang turo niyo sa mga anak niyo. 
every subject that I have, my mother said, make friends with people that has a brain. Get to know them. Be friends with them. Huwag kang magpakitang gilas na alam mo eh, hindi mo alam eh. That's my mother. So what I did, every subject I have to make friends. I am contaminated with the grades. I am contaminated with the brain. I am contaminated with the idea. I am contaminated with everything that they do and the secret that they are doing in how they do it. Eh, hindi ako ang nag-receive ng grade ko. Yung nanay ko, kasi siya ang pumperma. Ano lang kung may bagsak ako, eh, sinuforce ko yung ano. Pero alam ang nanay ko, if I am the one who is forging the signature of my, my mother, because my mother is tough. Sabi niya, <clears throat> oh, improve naman ang mga grades mo. Did you do what I said? Yes, mother. Sabihin niyo sa mga anak niyo. Kaya yun ang ginagawa ko sa pamangkin ko. Sabi ko, Anak, alam ko ikaw madagal ka. Pero may witness ka. Huwag kang magpretend na alam mo yan kasi hindi mo alam. Kaya yun, pumupunta ka sa akin at hinahanap mo sa akin yan. So ang ginawa itong ano, pamangkin ko, lahat yung mga homework nila, they are in group together. Sabi ko, you just listen. Get the idea and do your own thing in your own way. And share to everybody too. That is the other side of the story. Pero dito sa Hong Kong, let's go to the side of Hong Kong. Alam nyo ba, dito sa Hong Kong, there are a lot of bad companies. There are a lot of attorneys out there. Attorney not yet. Kung may problema ka dyan, pumunta ka sa labas, anong sabihin, ano ba ang binigay sa'yo? Ano ba ang pinayo sa'yo? Isn't it that it is very confusing? Isn't it confusing? They confuse you. Good advice, don't confuse. Kahit dito sa church. You have, and we have to be wise, what kind of people that we are talking with. You want to gain wisdom, then talk to the people that has. That has already proven, tasted, and what else? Sabi nga sa science, eh, so is science. It's not science that is a big pa science swimming in the ocean. It is a science that is verified and tested. The same thing with people that you're going to talk with. Makita mo dun sa ano niya eh, dun sa, pag, sa pananalitan niya eh. Di ba? Kaya pumunta ka dun sa, ka, sa ano, sa kasitmit mo, eh pareho sa kayo. Ha? Huh? And what happened? Then you go with them and then all of a sudden you are not gone. The loneliness is growing problem in the society. And there's death. This is here. <clears throat> According to the Bible, everyone needs a friend. We need friend. That is why it tells us to be better than one. In Ecclesiastes 4.9. Right? Everyone needs to be loved and to love. You need attention. You need to seek a good friend that gives you and that will encourage you to do what is right and to do what is good. Ang sakit God says, remember that you have to know, you have to feel too. This is about the management of our steward as a good steward. Nakautang ka, bayadang. Be trustful. Nakakautang ka. Idi, ora itata. And that's the reason why we are all here. But we need to pay it. Sika mag ka nagpautang ka nagpautang, itihan mo nga kaya ang alipatan. Allah, huwag kang magpautang kung hindi mo kayang limutan yan. The word of God says, and do not put interest, anong nangyari? Anong nangyari dito sa ano? Sa Hong Kong. Ano 
no siak ti agarami ti ag tiliw ka kita. Ano? Yung kong? Time six. And that is against the law. Isa nga talaga nga pupuwon tayo. Tida tayo na. Uh, tida tayo ti atitin mo yun. Pangata niyo. Because I went through that. I went through that. Friends. Nasakit, di ba? The Bible is just patas. Ag pautang ka, brother Chris, di kaya mga limutan. Ang ka nga ag pautang, tihan mo nga kaya nga. Ano ti ilo ka na na, ilo ka na ti limutan? Lipatan. <laughs> Ano siya kung ako ako tangapat? 500 lang? Pero so, kaya ako nga nila. Ano mag-iti Pilipino? 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 Ano Basta! Makitang ti Pilipino niya. Pautang. Pautang. You know, I can survive with 20 dollars. I can... I... And you know, God is just so faithful. Before I start working, I didn't have money. You know what happened? When I went there, grandmother prepared for my octopus. I almost break into my cry. Grandmother prepare prepare for my allowance every day. I don't know how in the world he trust she trusted me. You know, I said God. Even the lilies in the valleys, in the birds, in the sky, God look after them. How much more to His children if we adhere of what He's going, He's doing, He's saying. You know, I want to That to you, amen, including myself. I'm not saying I'm holy and you're not. Everybody went into that. But we need to ikagumaan tayo ti pumanaw kan mang aramin iti umisu. And so we have to come up with a solution in order to come together to help each other. For your own benefits too. 